Hey, welcome back to Solopod after fucking so long. Jesus, I don't know why I waited so long to come back to this game. Um, I guess I just didn't want to play Ocarina of Time again. I don't know. I love it. So last time, I clearly remember what happened last time though. Is uh, I fought the Skelfos and I fucking died a lot, and by a lot I mean once. Um, so I gathered some uh, fairies. So, um, all three of my bottles are full of fairies. So, this is definitely going to help in this battle. And the only pain in the ass part about this battle is not the fact that I have to fight these with only three hearts. I mean, that is, that is one pain. But, uh, it's the fact that I have to fight two of them in, like, basically a time limit. Come on. Okay, so you're dead. So now that's going to come down. Going to have to fight two of them. Get the fuck away from me. Fuck you. I'll, I'll fucking... I'll fight you. Which I clearly am doing right now. What? Like, I'd rather not waste... Oh, shit. Waste my hearts. Or waste my fairies, so I'm gonna... Yeah. Alright, now I, I gotta kill this one fast. If I could actually target him, that'd be nice. Come on. Oh, that was fucking beautiful. Didn't even need those fairies. Didn't even need those fairies. Man, my mixer is loud. Alright, all right. Okay. Oof. That was exhilarating. And I got a bow. The fairy bow. Ah. All right. So you press C to take it to hold. It has to hold it down. And I know how to play this game. Thank you. All right. So now that's gonna get equipped. Save whatever. Sure. A backflip, cool. Collect that. Man, I didn't even need to use those fairies. I don't know what, like, I just, I was just awesome this time around, which is, well, awesome. Alright, so we got two, we got two boos to defeat now, boos. That, that's a Mario thing. A Poe to defeat. So, easy way to do this. So, if you get close to these paintings, uh, the Poe disappears. Uh, this is a good spot for you to not be too close to those two paintings, so then you could just shoot them. And then this is the last painting he ha he can go to, so he can't run off to a different painting. So then you just do that, and then uh, you do a boss fight, a mini boss fight. All right, ow. All right, so what I like to do is I just I just block, and I just wait wait for the block again. He becomes visible, jump attack, and then. You just kind of rinse and repeat. A lot of time people forget that you have a shield. And then, ah, uh, well. So then, stuff like this happens. Where, like, you just get keep on trying to dodge and hit. But it's like, wait, you have a shield. Don't fucking... Don't just sit there and get hit. Which is me in, like, any, like, 2D fighting games. I never block, ever. I'm all attack or dodge. But sometimes you just have to think strategically, like what I'm doing right now. I'm fucking, I'm doing the smart. I just did the smart. Well, plus I've played this game about a half a million times. So, I know all the strats. I'm a cool kid on the block, knowing all about the Ocarina of Time back in 97. I didn't know anything about Ocarina of Time until like, at least 99. I wasn't old enough in 97, sadly. But you know what? It's fine. Look at that. Fucking hearts. And now, in this room, we have to do the same exact thing. But this time, he's blue. See? He's blue. Oh no, he went away. Too bad I could do the same exact thing like I did before. Jesus Christ, the sensitivity is insane. Alright. Hey, what's up? Alright, so it's literally the same exact fight. 
nice and easy. What's up? You, uh, smurf. You're a smurf because you're blue. And that's like the only thing I could make fun of you for. Is that you're blue. Dabby dee dabba die. Hi. Okay, I have an itch, but I need to use both of my hands. Oh, wait. Never mind. I'm used to having it set on hold, not switch. For the uh, Z target. So I could literally just let go and not hold the Z target button. Eh, eh, die. See, I, I, I do, like, I, I do wish, like, boss battles like this didn't have me wait too much. Oh, I, I hit him twice for that time. Um, like, maybe, maybe there is a strat for making him visible again. I don't know. Uh, maybe, maybe there is a strategy, not just a strat. You need the a G after it to make it a full strat. What? I don't even know what I'm talking about anymore. Let's open this chest. I believe it's a compass. Because if it... I already got the dungeon item, so it's going to be either a dungeon map or a compass. I already have a dungeon map, so it's a compass. Hey, look, a compass. Looky there. Alright, so let's just collect all that shit. And uh, let's uh, go on our merry way. Uh, we probably will beat this temple by the next episode. So, I just... Want to point that out? All right, so now we're in a different. Hey, eat a penis, you fucking fairy ass motherfucking. Yeah, I mean, we were just in the room that had that exact same thing. It's not even that scary anymore. I'm an adult. I can fucking, I can slice. Just like an argument I, I'm having online about realism in games and how that's not an argument for if you like a game or not or if a game is better than another game like yeah if you like realism i did not press that button uh like if you like realism in your game's fine but that doesn't mean the game is better just because it's more realistic especially this one guy was like i like realistic games because i'm an adult and i'm like eat every bag of dick ever you fucking piece of shit like being an adult means nothing that, that's like a response a 14 year old would give just because he thinks he's fucking cool and like he's trying to act older. It's like, oh, I only play fucking first person shoes because I'm so fucking cool. Fuck you. Yeah, did you ever think about that? Did you ever think about go fucking yourself? I bet not because you think you're too cool to do that. Fuck you. Doing these solo pauses are great because then I could do stuff like that. I don't have to make a separate rant video. I could just play a fucking game and then rant in the game. Especially in a game like this where... not There's not always something going on. Sometimes it's backtracking. And then during the backtracking and trying to figure out what to do. Which I I know what to do. Now I just have to backtrack to do the thing I need to do to get the small key so I can continue on to the rest of the dungeon. Um, I could just fucking bitch about things. I could just talk, 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 and talk and just talk all up in this mic and shit. So, the, the, this room is twisty, and we got arrows. There is an eye in this room, and if you ever play any other Zelda game ever, even if you are going in how in order of games that were made, you already know this mechanic of shoot the eye with an arrow. Link to the Past used it all the time. I'm, I'm just, just making a point. Uh... So now, now this hallway is straight, which is pretty cool. Uh, and a boundary break shows that it literally just fucking, it doesn't twist. It just like kind of just gets replaced, which makes sense. Hey, look, it's a golden chest. So this is the first time we've ever seen a golden chest. You know what fucking golden chest has? It has one item. And it's always going to be a boss key. So you got to make sure you get that golden chest. And I'm just going to move around. It's gonna crash. So yeah, that's just I'm pretty sure I showed this before, but that's the strategy of dealing with wall masters is uh <laughs> just move and then they'll not hit you. What's up? Fuck damn it. Fuck you. So these blue flames are not as bad as they are in Shut the fuck up. Um as they are in Majora's Mask. Where Majora's Mask, if you get hit by them, you cannot use your sword for, you know, however many seconds. It's like, oh, you got hit by the blue flame, now you can't use things. 
It's like, why? And granted, they're only in Terminal Field, but still a pain in the dick. At least, I only remember them in being in Terminal Field. Um... So I could go in that room, or I could go in that room. I'm gonna go in this room, because I think this is a dead-end room that I, it has a key. What's up, Wallmaster? Ow. Dick. Yeah. Fuck you. And now you're gonna have babies. And then I'm gonna kill your babies. Boom. You think that I was just, I wasn't gonna do that that bad? Yeah. Those words. And I love how they all gave me magic pots. Even though I don't, there's nothing required in this dungeon to use magic. Required. Optional stuff, but not required. All right, we're back here, going through this door. Yay! So then, this just literally just leads you right back into going into the other room. It's like, think like if you know exactly what to do and when to do it. Dungeons seem very linear. If you know when to do shit. Because then everything does tie in together real nicely. Like, real nicely. Um. I mean, later on, it can get, like, the, f the fire temple is a little eh, and then the water temple is not linear at fucking all, and I hate it. Uh, cause it has 5 million keys and you don't know which room you've been before and you're like, where do I get the key? Uh, and then, like, I always, there's always one door by, like, near the end of the temple that I always miss a key for, so now I'm fucking going all over the goddamn temple just to find out what the key. That is also partly the reason why I stopped playing. <laughs> um. I forgot what I was doing. I think I need to bring this room back. Yeah, that's, that's it. Um, yeah, and that's another reason why I stopped playing is because I, do I really want to play the Water Temple? But I want to finish the series. I want to do a three-heart run of this game. And I need more solo pod because it's been hard to record for a uh, regular play pod. So I want to get more content out there to fill in the space of play pod. So, you know, motivations. They exist. Uh, that's not how I want. What the fuck? Okay, that was interesting. I'm just gonna walk away from that. And, um... Go, just, just go. I'm just gonna go. You don't have a heart. Wow, so you, you contain hearts ev just once. Once ever. Cool. Probably, like, if I restarted the game, it'll have hearts, but... Whatever. Does it look like I give a dick? I don't give any dicks, because you're a dick, dick. Ah, I missed. Climb fast, because the ceiling master is going to kill us all. Hey. I am not... Ugh. I have to be so specific with my button presses. Because it's not actually C buttons. What? All right, so this is a nice little puzzle. Oh God! Oh Jesus! Why did I do that? Okay, let's do this again. Ah! So now we just wait. So we make our own fire arrows here. So we just kind of aim this up, and when we go across that, boom! And then that makes that twisty. So we need a key just for that. This room has no other purpose than for that. What? Oh, so fucking close. Whatever. Whoa, oh, man, really? There's no ladder on this side? You're gonna make me do... You know what? I'm not gonna make this a waste. See? Now I got shit. Fuck you. I'm, I'm not gonna have you bull me around, you dick. Why should there be a ladder on the other side? No, there's not. This game is truly just being a penis. There we go. Made it fast. Alright, so just bypass you. It's hard to go in a circle when you're already in a circle. Weirdos. 
All right. Okay. All right. Just drop. And so I believe I go up there. So I'm just gonna. Aha. Fuck. Damn it. So uh, let's just go up here. Go in here. No. Let's go back. I'm confused. Do I go down here? I'm gonna go down here. I do go down here. All right. So there's a room there. There's a room there. I'm just gonna double check things. Okay, this is how you get back here. All right, just making sure of shit. All right, so this room is actually interesting. So that thing falls. So watch out! This I get it. So then you gotta know where the uh, square areas are, and try not to get hit by the uh, the the, the things, scotulas. I don't know. I couldn't remember the name. So that one's gonna fall. You're gonna get that key. Or arrows. I'm gonna sit here, not get crushed. There's an extra space so I don't actually die. And boom. All right. Now this Poe is very different. Um. So what we're gonna do? Boom. It's gonna shake. We got one minute to put him together. So only four of these blocks are useful. And you gotta know which one is and isn't. So obviously we already used the uh, arm. So now we just gotta put this back together. And really it's all, it's basically already together. You just gotta push them together and which is why they only give you a minute because it is relatively easy uh, I mean to a child this would be a little bit harder uh, and to somebody who just played it the first time they have to really kind of think about it but see and I only have 15 seconds to spare but so getting him is different fighting him is the exact same can't do that did that work Eh. Okay, so there. So if you just use that, yeah, there we go. See, see, Eagle Raptor, you don't have to wait for everything. You can just figure out how to beat things faster. It's strategy. Sorry, I was. I'm just. I'm just making the point. <laughs> Ocarina time is great. Um. Link to the Past is great. Every, every Zelda game is great. Except for CDI, but that doesn't count. And, like, I don't like 2 that much. Adventures of Link. I it's To me, it's not that true of a Zelda game, but I can see why people like it, but it's not a personal... Like, it's definitely on the bottom of the list. Even Skyward Sword has its moments. Why did I press that button? I wanted to backflip over here. I couldn't. Alright, so this one is the mo absolutely most different of the four so this one it does a clone thing and then you gotta figure out which one is the real one which he has a tell just d do it he's not doing it he did it so ah so let's have him show up again So the one you see twirl is the one that is the fake. Or the real one. The other oh, three are fake. Duh. You're not trying to shoot the fake. And then you just, boom. You hit him with an arrow. Make it easy. Because you can't hit him with a sword because he follows you. Okay, it's that one. And Twilight Princess did borrow this idea. So if you play Twilight Princess and you did the Sand Temple... This is the re this, this is the idea. Wow, this one's not just a color. It's a it's Meg. This pose name is Meg. 
God damn it, Meg. There we go. Nice and dead. And that is all Fior Kialiers. So next time, we will finish this temple and then probably even start the next one. Uh, get pretty fucking close to it at least. So next time, it'll be taking the elevator down to Poundtown. Town.